hello and welcome in this video I'm going to show you how to get data for foreign direct investment FDI from Anktod database so first of all we look at Anktod database and then go to um, um, Anktod statistics we're looking at data center so when we click on data center they give me various options about various um, variables that I can look at so we're talking about uh, macroeconomics so we have like um, uh, foreign direct investment financial resources population commodities informal economy creative economy and maritime transport so we're looking at foreign direct investment we click at foreign direct investment flows and stocks and then I will have the all list all years showing all economies so we start by one by one number one so you click on years and will allow you to select how many years you want um, I would say um, selecting if you if you're looking at time series analysis selecting 20 years is good it's up to you how many years you want not all countries they have data about foreign direct investment from 1970 so you need to look at the quality of this data provided so for this video i'm looking at foreign direct investment let's say from 1970 and then i'm going to choose the economy so um, if I'm looking at, um, um, you can look at um, individual economies. You can look at also um, economic blocks, like you're looking at uh, European Union. You're looking at, um, let's say, NAFTA. You're looking at. You can also look at um, developing economies, transition economies, and developed economies. So you can select all of them, part of them. You can look at also um, geographical locations as well. Um, you can look also at the classification of World Bank classification as um, high income uh, developing economies, um, middle income developing economies and also you can look at low income developing economies so we have different categories different classifications um, for this video i'm going to concentrate on um, um, the middle east so we're going to choose a country like saudi arabia And then we'll go to direction. We're interested in onward uh, rather than outward. So we're looking at also the mode. So we've got flow and the stocks. Let's take both of them. And then we're looking at the measure. So you've got US dollars, current prices. Um, there's those current prices bit capita percentage of so um percentage of um, so i've got a percentage of gross domestic product so this is a good one because if you're using other data like uh, micro uh, macro data uh, like uh, population as a percentage of um, of gdp um, um inflation as a percentage also it's good to use foreign direct investment as a percentage so um, we're not interested in these we are looking also so percentage of total world this is just to give you indication about um, the share of um, Saudi Arabia of um, our foreign direct investment inflows um, we're looking at um, so, 
So let's look at the percentage of um, GDP. And so foreign direct investment as a percentage of GDP and percentage of total world. We're looking at also um, US dollar at current prices in millions. So just to show you uh, um, how the volume of foreign direct investment um, moving into Saudi Arabia each year. Okay, so when you finish, you need to uh, select show table. Okay, and here you've got Saudi Arabia on the top and we've got other economies. So we need to, what we need to do, we need to click at the X to um, clear all other selections. Okay, and then we select Saudi Arabia again. Yeah select and then you've got here if you can see um, yeah so we've got uh, two rows by 48 columns so let's have a look at the table again yeah so you've got one economy which is Saudi Arabia and then you've got all the years and uh, you've got the measure so after you finish you've got the table the best thing to do is just to download your data as an excel file and then you select save and then You wait for the file. Um, yep. So you've got here our data, um, Saudi Arabia, all the years, and you've got. Um, so what we've got in here is just um, um, the measure. US dollar at current prices in millions. So let's go back. And select the other measure, which is percentage of um, percentage of total world. So it will give you the percentage, how it is improving, and then from um, 1990 start to be like we see fluctuations and then start to be like a positive. So, means um, since 1990, I would say this is the start of getting more um, share of um, friend that world. Um, inflows into um, Saudi Arabia and you can also um, download this as an exit file and then you've got the last measure which is percentage of gross domestic product so by doing that we can see um, that we've got all the data about um, foreign direct inflows, foreign direct investment inflows, FDI inflows into Saudi Arabia from 1970 until 2017. And um, 
this is as a percentage of GDP so it's good also to get um, um, other macro data you can refer to my previous video about getting data from World Bank to get uh, the main uh, macroeconomic issues in order to start analyzing data about Saudi Arabia thank you for watching